Welcome to our Robot Structural Analysis Professional course for the design and analysis of steel frame structures. This time, we bring you a step by step course for the design and analysis of steel frame structures following both the American and Eurocode standards. During this course, useful for both the metric and imperial systems, we'll take you through the typical design and analysis workflow in Robot Structural Analysis Professional so you can achieve an efficient and safe design of common steel frame structures. Thus, the main purpose of this course is that you learn the proper methodology that will allow you to carry out the design and analysis of standard steel structures, which while complying with the governing code, offer safety and stability against the design loads, code combinations, and even some extreme weather conditions. With this objective in mind, we will take you from the simple approach of the structural model to the analysis of the steel members, verifying their integrity, stability, and even efficiency in relation to the governing design code. Furthermore, a very important aspect that we'll observe during this course is the design and analysis of the connections, as these are critical for ensuring the stability and thus the safety of the structure. Taking you through all the necessary steps without you needing to have previous experience with robot structural analysis professional. Along these lines, another interesting topic we'll approach is the design and optimization of the steel sections. Namely, finding the most adequate design of these in relation to the considered load cases and code combinations, including those corresponding to the wind loads and the resultant pressure and suction effects caused by these over the structure. Also, so you can fully understand the effects of these types of loads on the structure, we'll take care of working with both claddings and orthotropic panels, since the presence of these elements may affect the structure's integrity, and even stability against these and the assigned design loads. At the same time, this design and analysis process will take us to review the different diagrams of results, such as those corresponding to the internal forces, reactions, and deformations produced across the structural model thus allowing us to understand the structure's behavior, facilitating design decisions. For instance, based on the observed results and behavior of the structural model, we may opt for the use of tapered sections, as these may offer a better solution when working with large spans. We'll observe all this process in a step-by-step -step fashion so you can achieve a stable, efficient, and safe structural design that simultaneously complies with the governing code. Finally, and if you have any doubts regarding the tools and subjects covered during this course, remember that you can always contact our support center for assistance. So all these topics and more will be widely covered in our Robot Structural Analysis Professional course, for the design and analysis of steel frame structures.